I'm getting dread today. Yeah? It's official. Today, I'm giving my son some dreadlocks. All right, y'all, before we get into today's video, make sure to go subscribe to Kellen's YouTube channel. He just started one, and there's no videos on it yet, but there's gonna be really cool content on there. It's gonna be pretty cool to see what he actually creates on there. And he actually just created an Instagram, so you can go check that out as well. Both the links are in the description. But yeah, go support him because it's gonna be a whole bunch of hair, fun, and life stuff. You can see that on his YouTube banner, but yeah, go support him, go show him some love. And it's gonna be really cool because he has so much hair. There's gonna be so much to be able to do with it. Like we do so much with his hair, but we just never film it, we never document it. So it's gonna be cool to see him be able to do all that. So like I said, after you watch this video, make sure to go subscribe to him, go follow him on Instagram, and welcome Kellen to the social media world. This ought to be interesting. Here, here, here. Today's video is sponsored by Desor Hair. You can check out all their stuff in the link in the description. Yeah, we're working with 100% real human hair. We're gonna put them in my hair. So it's real plain and simple. I'm gonna walk you through the process. First things first, I'm going to spray down his hair, put some leave-in conditioner, and then brush through his hair so that it's all good and comb through. And then I'm gonna section it out and then I'm gonna install the dreadlocks. not that nappy. She's been laid down all day. Expectations versus reality. My hair's pretty nappy right now. What is that? It's like a mister. Sounds like a gun. Now I'm gonna spray in some leave-in conditioner. I'm gonna be recording that part. Alright, now we're gonna attempt to comb this bad boy up. Alright guys, time to install these bad boys. But first thing first, I'm going to get all the separations on his head. So I'm gonna start out with the middle part. So we just want to make 20 equal sections on his head because we have 20 dreads. So we're just gonna try to get them as best as possible. I was gonna go in and rubber band all the roots, but I'm actually just going to go ahead and just do them one by one. All right, so I got my first section right here. As you notice on the actual dreadlock itself, it has a loop at the top. And then what you're gonna do is you're basically gonna thread this section of hair through that loop, and then you're gonna braid it in. So you push the latch hook through the, the loop. You wanna grab this hair and then pull it through this loop. 
If you want to make sure that the sections are perfect, you want to make sure to get all that hair through that loop. So as you guys can see, all that section is through that single loop. So now what you're going to do is basically split this section and then braid it as if you're braiding natural hair. And obviously this is a different color than his hair, but you can color match on Desor. They have plenty of hair colors, but um, just for the sake of the video and the tutorial, um, we went with this color. Don't roast me. So now, like I said, all you're gonna do is separate these two, and then now you're gonna go in and braid these three strands together. A whole kind of blend. Yeah, it looks great. And when you're braiding, you kind of want to keep the braid as tight as possible to the actual dreadlock, just because you don't want it to go all the way down the length of the actual dread. So now that you have this part all braided down, you don't want it to go really far down. You want to keep it kind of at the base of the dreadlock. You can see that there's more than half on the actual length. And right now I'm just going to tie this off. You can choose any way to tie this off. You can use a bead or you can just use um, these little rubber bands, which that's what I'm going to be using. This is what it looks like, and this is what faux dreadlocks look like. Obviously, they're not gonna look 100% real, like authentic dreadlocks, but this is a route that a lot of people with straight hair dreadlocks do, or anything like that. So, this is actually a solution that will work for you. Like I said, you can check out all their stuff in the link in the description, but I'm gonna finish the rest of his head, and then I'll show you guys the finished look. What's up, guys? Look at all these dreads, dude. Yeah, boy, you already know. to try it out. Oh. Would you ever get dreadlocks? Maybe. No. No, I'm just no. Curly hair or dreadlocks? Curly hair. Cause I can do anything with curly hair. I can make braids that look like dreadlocks. What's your favorite <laughs> hairstyle? My favorite hairstyle is braids. Which ones? I don't know what they're called. Corn rolls. If I can have like one hairstyle my whole life, I'll pick these exact braids. What do you want to tell everyone? You guys should all try this out. What's that brand called? I pulled the box over here. Everyone, everyone, brand, yeah. everyone needs to order the, a pack of this. Get some 20 dreads, pop them in. They could do more than 20 Oh, oh. Yeah, you guys all need to try this out. Oh, Rasta, man. Yeah. <laughs> all right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed today's video. We did this on Father's Day. It was pretty cool. They actually surprised me earlier, and I got some barks and you know, my trophy. This is my Father's Day trophy. The greatest son in the world built it. Yeah. I'm the MVP. 
Most Valley Pops alert. But you guys, I'm really hungry, but before I jump off of into this, make sure to go check out Desor Hair. Come check out. Nice, that's a hairstyle. Yep. Sweet, you can do a bun, you can put it in a bun? No, no idea. Okay. Well, you guys, make sure to go check out Desor Hair. Link is in the description. You can check out all their dreadlock um, products, all their hair products and everything like that. Uh, they also have crochet hooks and latch hooks for interlocking and they also do dreadlock jewelry like beads and stuff like that but all their stuff's in the link in the description do you guys think Kellen should keep these dreadlocks comment down below if he should keep them cut them uh, just get rid of all of his hair in general comment down below if you guys wanted to get anything from diesel hair you can use my discount code gunther8 for eight dollars off any of your purchases and there's also a bunch of other promo codes down below you can check those out but hopefully you enjoyed today's video if you did give it a thumbs up i'll see you guys next time hopefully you guys do an amazing day matter of fact have a great day peace out god bless